Dr. Joseph Sacren knows about the importance of second chances. At 17, he was just starting his senior year at Lake Braddock. He'd been to his high school football game and was with friends at a nearby playground when suddenly a stray bullet from someone else's disagreement struck him. I went from being a healthy 17-year-old high school student uh, to collateral damage after I was shot in the throat with a 30 caliber bullet. My entire life changed. He underwent multiple surgeries and spent weeks in the hospital, but recovered eventually, grateful to be alive and determined to make the most of his second chance. After 28 years, the playground where that shooting happened is still here. Dr. Sacron says he remembers that as the worst day of his life, but he also says it was the most impactful day of his life. Dr. Sacron says the care he got after he was shot inspired him to pursue a career as a trauma surgeon. He's now in charge of emergency general surgery here at Johns Hopkins Hospital in Baltimore. My vision was that I just want to be able to give someone else the same second chance that I was given. But his work is difficult, pulling in 24-hour shifts each day, reminding him of the devastating cost of gun violence on our streets. You know, every day, we're having to explain to, you know, moms and dads and to loved ones that their child that left that morning is never coming home again. And when I think about that, I just honestly, a piece of me dies every time. Gun violence is now the leading cause of death among children and adolescents in the U.S., claiming more lives than car crashes or cancer. Those who survive a shooting face grim odds. 40% will end up right back in the hospital with another gunshot wound within five years. But Dr. Sacron sees that as an opportunity to intervene. As a survivor, um, I'm able to build that kind of rapport because they know that I understand what they've been through in some ways. He's also working to bring change outside the operating room as the founder of Docs Demand Action, a group of physicians calling for tighter gun legislation, including universal background checks. We have both the opportunity and the responsibility to be part of that change beyond simply the four walls of the hospital. This is not a Democratic issue. It's not a Republican issue. This is a uniquely American issue that we face. So I think we have to kind of move beyond, you know, the divisive and, and partisan rhetoric and talk about what are we doing to protect our children? Dr. Sacron has traveled all over the country sharing his story to raise awareness about gun violence. He believes the best way to save lives is to prevent the violence from happening in the first place. Mm -hmm.